Well, it's going to be another hot day. Um, stopping before work again this morning. Thought I'd hunt a little bit. Got an interesting spot here to putter around with. Been abandoned for a long time. And uh, it's been a place of shenanigans for the local kids. And I'm guessing there's probably a thing or two here that is worth hunting for. I'm not sure the history on the old place. I know the owner of the property. It's uh, seen better days. Foundations and the walls are still pretty darn sturdy. I guess in the house by the look of it was from the 50s or maybe put it in the 60s somewhere in there. We're gonna fire up the Equinox 800 and uh, work a little bit of this yard. You can see where they had the, the yard and the driveway. I'm walking on the old driveway. There's a wash back in these trees in the back. Who knows what's in there. It's probably where the kids played a lot, if they had kids. So, you ought to be a little bit of fun poking around in here. Shenanigans. No place has seen better days. We got a beehive. It appears. They're going in that hole right there. Honeybees. Well, without further ado, I'm going to fire up that detector and have a look around. You know, I got a target right in here. It's coming up 2021. 20, Good solid hit. But man, the trash here is incredible too. Look right there by the coil. It's part of a shotgun shell or something, I don't know. But if you look around, we got bed springs here. We got just nails and tin and you name it. You name it. Typical trashed house here in Arizona. You know, let's dig this thing up. See what might be there. I got this speaker on today for you folks. Lots of trash here. I can't even hardly move the machine without hearing something. Right there it is. Popped right out. It's a penny. Copper penny. Um, 1975. How about that? Right next to all that trash. First target. First good target anyway. Back at it. Well, this one was pretty obvious. There was a uh, 17, steady 17 with a folded up beaver tail right on the surface. Right 
there. Another penny signal here. Nineteen and twenty. Clad. Um, 2011. Pretty rough shape already. Yeah. Just dug up a little 25 auto casing right there. Interesting target numbers it was right same as the nickel right around 13 pretty solid too it's just a, a little fired cartridge I'm going to spare you most of the trash digs today I mean if you look around look at there's a piece of a shotgun a eh, can laying there but that's I mean, those are kickable out of the way right here we got a shell casing from a 9mm, it looks like. Those are a pretty good signal. And uh, a lot of this stuff's laying right on top. You know, if you look around, nails in the boards, some sort of steel plate, more nails. Um, geez, there's beaver tails, bottle caps, you name it, man. And uh, it's just blowing me away at this detector. It's almost just in stock settings. I've got it in park one and uh, I've got my ground balance and my other settings all good. I've done my noise cancel. It's sure doing a good job in here. We've got a uh, target here. This one. A lot of trash right here. But I'm able to squeak it out a 23, 24, 25, along with a lot of other crap. Let's see what it is. Sounds like it's still down there. There's a nail in the hole with whatever it is. That could have been my trouble. It's here. There it is, right there. Silver. Silver. Roosevelt dime. Roosevelt dime. Hey, uh, Nineteen sixty four. How about that, huh? Silver, two days in a row. Not bad, not bad. I'm loving this detector. We got another target here. This one is strange. We've got a nine over here, too. It's a nine. Good solid nine. Up and down, no fluctuation. We got another one here. Same thing, nine. It's a 
solid nine. Um, and somewhat new to this thing. I'm gonna dig these because it's a good solid target. Hmm, interesting. Ah, it's a coin. I don't, I don't think you got the camera aim quite right. It's laying right here. What the heck is that? Ten cents with a seagull on it. Heck is Barbados? <laughs> Barbados. I can't see a date. I wonder if that's silver. No, I'm gonna come up a nine. That's an odd, odd number. Anybody got any ideas on why that would come up as a nine? I have no clue. I've never seen anything quite like that. Oh my god, another. Signal just like it. Right over here. Oh, we position the camera a little bit. I know, I know. Okay, let's see what this one is. Another Barbados coin. We're at nine. Oh, no, see, this one's right on the surface. That's a uh, 22 casing made out of. Not sure what it's silvers, steel. I don't know, stainless steel. Those two rang up exactly the same. Huh. Well, back at it. Well, another fun morning. This place turned out to be pretty cool. Might come back. Found uh, two clad pennies clad dime. <laughs> yeah, I always get that clad. But, uh, one of the, the coolest parts is I got a 10 cent piece from Barbados in the Arizona desert. Figure that one out. And a uh, Roosevelt silver. And a bunch of trash. So here's my finds for the day. real fancy. You know, it was fun. It was fun, and I, I found a place I think I want to come back to. We, uh, we worked the front part over here. Front part of the yard. I think I'm going to uh, work around the other side next time I come. So, as always, if you're enjoying these things, Please subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.